Hello. <laughs> February. <clears throat> oh, how cute. <laughs> My Valentine. And it's the same thing. They look like little cookies. Oh, right. There's the folks on the back. Ta -ta -ta -ta. And. La 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 la. Stuffity stuff. Alright. Um, let's see what it says. Uh, chocolate cream. Nope. Hold on. It's hot cocoa, I think. I think. I don't know. I'm not even sure. Hold on. Um. I think it's hot cocoa. It says adorable bunny shaped marshmallows. That sounds adorable. Hot cocoa? Mm -hmm. this something which I loved but I can't have chocolate covered sunflower seeds, covered sunflower seeds. Mm -hmm. I know it sounds kind of weird but good. it's really not not bad I can't have them because I don't want to be in pain for days mm -hmm. <sighs> Sorry. I hate grapefruit, by the way. Hopefully the honey will make it not as bitter, though. The grapefruit is crazy bitter. Vita. That smells so weird. It's weird. It's shaped like like a drink with a lemon in the top or something. I mean, it smells weird. See, it's not as bitter as it would be if it was straight grapefruit. I mean, it's not as bad. I mean, it is kind of tart, but it's not as bad with the honey because the honey cuts some of that tart down. So, no. I have no idea. Okay, so. I'm not going to pronounce her name properly, mm -hmm. but from the group AOA, um, mm, So Hyun, uh, it says, based on the popular Korean style Chinese dish, instant noodles are covered with minced soy meat and vegetable packed black bean sauce that's cooked to perfection. Okay. So, like, Interesting. Uh, that's it's cool. not ramen. It's uh -huh. a word I can't pronounce, and I'm going to sound like a dingleberry if I try. So, okay, so we've tried seaweed before. And we did not like it. And we were quite unhappy with ourselves for doing something so silly. Oh, boy. And this is a straight up bunny marshmallow. It's not even listed on here. It's 
Mm. It's not even listed on there. Unless you want to eat it. It's just a bunny marshmallow. If that's what it says on there. <laughs> oh god, that's cute. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. So did the hot chocolate have marshmallows in the little packet? Maybe. Well, I don't know. I mean, it, it's it's it looks like it's supposed to be a a box right there, but it does say something about um, bunny shaped marshmallow. That's good, yeah. So I think that's supposed to be paired with that, and that's maybe why you don't have a picture of it there. Because I also don't. Oh, there's the seaweed. Okay. But yeah, I don't do marshmallows, and that was a super cute marshmallow, by the way. That was. Mm. It's Um, it's a version of a popular Italian snack lined with apricot jam and fluffy pastry. It looks like something we've had before. I think we've had something similar before, but a different flavor. I don't like apricot, but I always smell things, even if they're nasty. The biscuit part's good. Mm -hmm. I didn't like the sweet part on the top. Mm -mm. I have a really bad issue with consistencies. Mm -hmm. That's gum, so we're going to save it for last. I think so. Yeah, might as well put that one aside. I think we got this gum in the last box. You want to show it? <laughs> it's cherry gum. It's got like these little crunchy things in there that while you're chewing it, it's got like little crunchies. Mm -hmm. A little extra flavor. Alright, is it my turn again? Mm -hmm. Um, let's see. Again. Um, we've had that before, but I'm gonna try again anyway. Cause it's delicioso. So this looks like it just says it's a cereal bar. Popeye. Okay, so you'll recognize the shape of those. We had it in a bag and it had like big sugary star things, which I didn't care for. Mm -hmm. But this has chocolate drizzle on top. Oh, it's hard. Mm. I gotta be a little careful right now. What bad? Could use a little more chocolate. Mmm. Mmm. Because I got that. It was like a little bag and it had like. The, they looked like. Um. Like chow mein noodles. But they had like these weird little sugar lumps in it. Mm -hmm. 
that were pretty good. That's pretty good. Um, <clears throat> Dropped up for the buttons. Melting on rice. Mm hmm. The extremely popular interview with the topic directly appears in the light of texture. These were literally melt to the mouth. I guess we'll see about that. Interesting. Ooh. There's not, there's not really any smell. It looks like a rice cracker. Mm -hmm. Kinda. Kinda like a rice cracker. Mm. Mm. Those are really good. Well, look for baby. Well, look for. What are you doing? What are you doing? What are you doing? <laughs> Alright, so there's two that are probably going to be supremely excellent, and two that are scary. Mm -hmm. Um, it's like a fall off, right? Mm -hmm. oh. Alright, let's go with... I should go with the one that's going to have the less of flavor. Support the process. Alright. <laughs> the pretzel has a smiley face on it. Captain oh, Flips. Please. Neither do I. Mm -hmm. We'll see how this goes. Hold the snatches. It kind of smells like veggie chips. Mm -hmm. Yeah, seriously, it smells like it. It's a pretzel. It kind of does look like a veggie chips. It tastes like like seasoned pretzels. Mm -hmm. Not spicy. It tastes like like if you had a straight up vegetable ramen mm -hmm. and you emptied the powder pack into pretzels. It does not taste fishy or seafoody at all. Mm -hmm. So it's time for now the other scary one. Mm -hmm. It's funny because like we see like is it like junk cook and human yeah. fighting over like <laughs> fighting over the um honey butter chips and I'm like the honey butter chips can stay far. This smells garlicky. Tastes like a soft cookie. It's garlicky. It like <laughs> Like, if you go to Olive Garden and get the breadsticks, it tastes just like that. And I don't like Olive Garden breadsticks. Sorry. Mm. Woo! Garlic. garlic. Butter garlic. I didn't taste butter. Which is nice, because sometimes when these things say butter, all you taste is butter.
Let's say that that it's okay. Whatever. I don't know. I can't read. No, I got hiccups now. Mm. Be garlicky. Because they taste like um breadsticks from Oh god, I have hiccups now. Well, mm -hmm. yeah. what these taste like because we've had them before. So, might as well save them for last. So, or just to shove them in your face. So, chocolate cream biscuit sandwiches. Or just shove them in your face. There's a chocolate. Oh, there's three in each package. Lovely, 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 lovely. So, you see this the only thing that worries me is it tastes like there's nuts in it. Maybe that's just the flavor of the of the cookie. Mm -hmm. But it tastes like it could be like chocolate almond spread, maybe. Mm -hmm. And if that's the case, I'm gonna have problems. Good though. See, flavors get thrown off too. Because we're used to chocolate here mm -hmm. kicking you in the face. Like, I'm chocolate. But with all of these things, unless it's like the garlic and like the, the seafood. Stuff, the salty in these Korean snacks is way down compared to the United States, and the sweet is not in sick, not sickening sweet like it is here. So the kind of flavor throws you off. These are cocoa hearts. Mm. It's my favorite with the cookies. Are back. And now come with the uh oh. Yeah. I can't have any kind of nuts. So, we did have chocolate ones before that were not hazelnut. Individually packed. Nice. I love when they do that because, especially if it's something that you don't care for, you can like have a friend. You know, where you can leave it for somebody like she does at work. But I think you like those. That one has hazelnut though, so that should be a different experience. But Andy would like it. <laughs> it's nice and Mm-hmm. My hair's falling out, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. Oh, I still got the garlic in my mouth. I eat onion garlic chips, so it's not like garlic is a bad thing. Cat sitting here, he's like, I thought this was my box. What was the favorite? Those chips. Fresh. 
these these rice crackery chips. They actually look like no, I love these. These are great. These are like the rice crackers. It doesn't have the sugar on them. Because mm -hmm. we did get one from a Japanese box that had Hello Kitties on it and it had like mm -hmm. strawberry swirls on it. And it was alright. I don't care for strawberry and it didn't really have a, a big strawberry flavor. But I like this a lot. Because mm. it's not too salty. It's just enough like sweet mm -hmm. and I eat rice like every day so here's my rice again today because mm -hmm. <laughs> I'm like constantly eating rice and a few things left my stomach will handle Right, Dana couldn't have any. <laughs> That's like, what? Why don't you just let him smell some? He can still smell it. Half the stuff you give him to smell, he's just like, huh? Let him smell the garlic thing. The cat likes salt. He's addicted to salt. He's like, nope. <laughs> so these are my favorite. These are really good. I mean, if you want to take your healthy rice snack and, like I said, you know, add, like, the sweet to it, you could always get yourself a little bit of, like, Hershey's and melt it down and drizzle it on the top. But it's really good. It has a, it has a really good balance of salty and sweet. I can't read to save my life. I, I, I've got to get back into trying to read Korean again because, like the very few that I could read, I've completely forgotten already. <laughs> So there's two different soup cups. Hmm. Let me see that one. Not the bit that well, actually, let me see both of them. This one we've had before, by the way. I'm almost completely positive of it. But this one looks like. Alright, it looks like it has eggs, mushrooms, beef. So it looks kind of like a beef, egg, and vegetable. <laughs> I know that says nongshim, but that's only because I knew that this one here says shim. So I knew that says. So, 
Holy halfway cheating. So I'm thinking definitely I mean actually if my diet wasn't so you know restrictive because I can't have seeds I can't have nuts nuts seeds raw vegetables I think my favorite would have been the sunflower seeds they're delicious they are so good like when I first got these boxes I was like I was like where's the chocolate from the seeds and then we got them and it was like oh. But with with last year, I said that I was not going to have any, you know, of the stuff that I wasn't supposed to be eating because of you know my stomach and whatnot. But I ended up, ended up, I end up. I think cheating twice, and I had had popcorn, which was just not a good idea. But this year, so far, so good. I've not eaten anything that I shouldn't. I know we're only at February, but give me a break. <laughs> I really, really want to eat these, though. I love sunflower seeds. Sunflower seeds have always been my favorite. Like, if you ever got, like, a package of just straight sunflower seeds without the shells that were like this, I would just be like, because I love sunflower seeds. But, I can't have pumpkin seeds anymore either. So, I mean, these would have been my favorite. My least favorite, those garlic balls. Mmm. <laughs> I don't know. Those garlic balls were kind of, but not as bad as it would have been if it wasn't any honey in it. Yeah. Like I said, the honey kind of mellows out how bitter uh, grapefruit can be. Mm -hmm. And we've tried seaweed before, and I know lots of people love seaweed, but That's we tried a, a couple of different kinds, and. Mm -hmm. But yeah, so. Now yeah, I'm still using my kitty blanket. <laughs> I gotta switch it out and use my ducky blanket that we got in the, the Tabak box next time. <laughs> <laughs> that one's coming anytime now. I've got the notice that it shipped. So, this is the pretty much the same company. So. I'll mention them tons of times in this video. The Tabak box is when I first started getting this subscription was a box that you would that they would give away like one every month. And I did win that once. Um I'm not sure how long ago. They, they stopped it for a stretch of time that I know of, but then they would just, they told everyone that they were doing this other box and that it would be seasonal. So we are getting our third one mm -hmm. <sighs> within probably the next two weeks it should get here. And so far, they've <laughs> been really good. Oh, yeah. Now the, um, the little Ryan bag that I got from the last one. This guy's face. I'm actually, I mean, it's a good size square pouch. There's a lot of, a pretty good amount of room in it, like this, this wide maybe. I'm gonna use that, I'm gonna put all first aid stuff, and then I'm gonna stick that in my car. So I have a cute first aid kit, instead of some little boring box. But, you know, it unzips, and I can put, there's inside their little mesh pockets, so you can put Band-Aids on one side, you can put the ointment on one side, or you could stuff the middle with band-aids of all different sizes, and then on the sides you could put wipes, tape, like alcohol wipes, the little medical tape, 
could put a little pair of those tweezers that every box comes with. And you can throw that little foil blanket they give you so you can keep yourself heated if you're stuck somewhere in the winter. Stuff like that. And I'm going to put that in my center console so that way there's, you know, my first aid kit. Because everyone should have a first aid kit in their car. So if you got that, if you got the last Tabak box and you don't know what to do with that, make a first aid kit and put it in your car. Nothing fancy, just triple antibiotic, band-aids, alcohol swabs, um, maybe some Q-tips, some tweezers. Um, some of the first aid kits come with a little thing with, like, it says burn gel, in case you get, like, a sunburn or something. Or if you do get um, their subscriptions, if you have, like, an aloe vera, you can stick that in there. So just make yourself a little first aid kit. It's worth it. It's cute. No matter which one you got, it'd be cute. Like a little first aid kit. I've always had one. I haven't, I haven't put one in my new car yet, but it's not really new. I got it in August. But I haven't put a first aid kit in that car yet, so got to definitely do that. But it's ver something you should really think of doing. And then you could even maybe throw like the gum or a few little packets of something. Because these a lot of these things are individually wrapped. Like those cookies that gives you two, three packs. These, they're individually wrapped. Mm -hmm. And there are six of them. So, I mean, you could, in case you get stuck in your car and need a snack, it's great for people who are diabetic and they have to have snacks. You can put a little Ryan pouch. Put some of these in there. You know, like when you get like the strawberry ones or, you know, different flavors that they have. So, yeah, I mean, tons of ideas. I use, you know, the calendar, I use the journal. You know, the planner, and it's, I think it's great. I can't wait for the next box. It's like, I think I accidentally saw a sneak peek of what's coming in it. I think I told you about it before. Mm -hmm. It said that the sneak was like a BTS toothbrush or something. Which is good, because I could use a new, another toothbrush. It's very important to not use the same toothbrush for like your entire life. Oh, yeah. Especially if you get like really sick or have like strap throw out your toothbrush. Well, that's why when you go to the dentist, that you sit on it. They give you a toothbrush. Yeah. Everything else so there you have it. That is February, and it's my time. <laughs> and the hello has got a little heart shaped thing. Oh. Super cute. Mhm. Mm Hello is young. And then this one here for introducing yourself. I'm pretty sure mine, because there's a couple of different ways to say it. And this one would be. Jonan, Dana, and Nida. My name is Dana. So, that one I remember. But, there you go. They always have that on the back. Always have some pictures of other openings. Tells you what you get and what box they come in. Because if you get the deluxe, you get both, as you can see, both are checked off. And then there are some items you only get in the deluxe, which would be everything on this first page, and then the first two items on the second page. So those last four items you see, you'd only get in... Right. So, both of the, the rest of these things are in everything. The last four are only in this one. So you, it's not a big difference, but... But the sizes are also bigger. Yeah. Like in the other one, I get like one pack of these. Some of these, you can get two or four bucks. 
But, so, I mean, yeah. So, I don't know where the sticker went, but that's okay, we'll find it. So, that was February. And... <laughs> so, that was February. And we shall see you when we do the next box. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> or our next video. Whichever comes first. Probably another video. So we'll see, ya. see ya. Bye.